Hello everyone, this will be the start of my Subnautica story mission navigation guide. If you didn't see my prior recordings, I'm going to start from the very beginning. It will take a while, and yes, I am not editing it. The reason I'm not editing it is because I want you to be able to see my compass as I'm going. So. This area is known as the Lost River. You will have to come down here eventually. So in the prior recordings, I jumped down from way up there and landed down here. There's a left and right entrance to this cave, which is part of the Lost River. So I'm going to point myself to the right side. going this way. And then we're just gonna make a long walk down here. I could have started this recording at the hole I needed to jump down, but I figured it would be easiest if people saw where to start from. So you'll notice I'm just following the right wall kind of staying in these acid lakes. There's a reason I said I want to be on the right hand side uh, in the very last of the mining navigation guides. It's because that hole at the very end puts me closer to the objective. Go down the uh, little waterfall of acid, following it again, keeping to the right wall, jumping down this waterfall, looking at that crevice right there, continuing down the right wall, and I see my destination. So, once you get over to this gigantic hole, you're going to drop straight down. Notice my uh, depth meter as well. Let's drop straight down. Going to avoid that plant right, right below me. Go down all here. And then you'll notice a skeleton sitting right up there. So we're going to take a left hand turn and fall the left hand wall once we make that drop, facing the skeleton, of course. So we're going to continue over here, and then once you get right here, you'll notice this pillar of light. This tells you, you that you are in the right area. You're going to make a jump from here. to get over here. And then you're going to go to that wall and follow it to your objective. I won't go all the way over there because I don't want to spoil anything for you, but that's how you get to one of the main story parts of this game. I think that you will want to do this as soon as you get the prawn. But uh, yeah, let me go ahead and end recording and we'll talk about the next part.